Isn't it fantastic that we live in an era where most questions can get answered? What is the tallest building? How many penguin species are there? Or even, who holds the world record of the most number of hot dogs one can consume in 10 minutes? Yep, that's actually a thing. The problem is, with health, accuracy, reliability is so, so important. And so, when you go to Dr. Google, you can search for all the answers to all of the questions you might have, but you don't really know whether they're accurate or not. And before you know it, you are going down a rabbit hole with more questions, more answers, and you're none the wiser. Breast cancer is the number one cancer that affects women. In the UK, about 55,000 women are diagnosed every single year, and around 370 men. And yes, you've heard that correctly, men can also get breast cancer. Although the outcome from breast cancer treatment is improving day by day, around 31 women die from the disease every single day. So that's one death every 45 minutes. That's quite a lot. So you might be wondering, what is the best way to examine your breasts? What can I do to minimize the risk of getting breast cancer? And if you've had breast cancer treatment, what are the strategies that you can adopt to minimize the risk of the cancer coming back? I have been a breast cancer surgeon for over a decade and with my expertise and knowledge, I am hoping to be able to answer various questions that you may have surrounding breast cancer and health. This is why I created this YouTube channel. I started this channel just under a year ago and I woke up this morning to over a thousand subscribers or followers and to every single one of you, I am eternally grateful. And the truth is, I wasn't even sure whether I was going to make this YouTube channel. It took me such a long time to finally decide to press record and just go for it. And there were a number of reasons why um, it took me a while to do that. I have a full-time job, so I wasn't sure whether I would have the time to do it. Um, I wasn't sure whether I'd be able to make the videos. I wasn't sure whether, you know, anybody would even want to hear me and listen to what I have to say. But I am obviously wrong because all of you are here following this channel and I am so, so grateful. I hope I can continue to serve you, provide useful and valuable information and if you haven't done so yet, I'd be really, really grateful if you could just leave a comment and let me know if there are any topics you want me to cover and say hi and connect with me. That'd be really, really awesome. In the meantime, thank you so much once again to this short celebratory episode, if you like, and I'll catch you in the next one. Take care.